so much, Elizabeth, for joining me um, to talk a little bit about your experience in the professional mentorship program. Um, it's going to be invaluable to folks who are who are curious to learn more to to know what the program is all about. I mean, professionally, I I manage projects. I'm manager of PMO, so I manage all sorts of projects. Um, originally, I was managing IT projects, but right now I um, I pivoted into mergers and acquisitions. Um, I run those kind of uh, projects. What really brought me to this is in the end of 2019, 2020, I, I just wanted to share my experience, share what I have, especially being an immigrant and settled here. And I see the benefits of being in Canada and what Canada has to offer. I was like, I need to find a way to really connect with the newcomer. The first meeting usually is just very short, get to know the mentee, and then get to know what they are looking for. So that's, I think it's the best thing to do. The other thing is, I think they have a lot of questions about the country itself, right? It's a new mm -hmm. country, new place. What is the culture here? What is the differences? So first thing I think is that intro to the get, get to know the culture. here. So first thing is to set that goals. What do we want to achieve? What is the, the mentees looking for? It's, it's basically it's for them. And the work is on their side more than mine. It's just, I am there on a weekly basis. We're going to follow up to make sure they're able to achieve that. They're able to find it. And then of course, support them. So it's kind of see the end and work backwards. The future is different. And then, then when I explain how I worked for me and then how it can work for them. Because the environment is very important for me. You be in the right environment, the right people who are really in the same way thinking about their new country, it's, it's key. It's how we are end of the day human beings and we need each other. In my brain is very simple. All of us, we want to succeed. All of us, we have dreams, hopes. We are a good listeners. Mm -hmm. I think people will benefit from it. And that's what I think it's kept going on a weekly basis. And then when you create that connection and then you see their growth and mm -hmm. their success all along, I think with every small thing we were celebrating and then the commitment from them as well, and it's marvelous to see. It's, I mean, every week they come you with an update. That's the beauty because in every week is a different. Still in touch with my um, mentees. I, unless they say we don't want, I never stop because life is evolving, right? They are growing yeah. from one stage to another, to another, to, to bigger and bigger and bigger. Mm -hmm. It's uh, one of the, I, I think one of the most fulfilling experiences of my life. It's just it's mm -hmm. very nice. Being yourself in um, in this society, I think that's that's what really moves moves them forward. I, I think just do, kind of they just do it. I think we all come with experiences. I think we all have something inside that the other person is seeking for it, but doesn't know where to find it. Your life experience is good enough for the person. You, whatever you have done in your life is good enough for the person. You lived in this country, you are thriving in this country, I'm sure you can you can help this new person. Mm -hmm. So I think just do it. It's, it's very, very fulfilling. It